This is really good, guys. Freaking delicious. Hey loves, it's Caddy and welcome back to my channel, Glam by Caddy. If you are new here, welcome. I upload a video every Sunday. And as you can tell from the title of this week's video, I will be doing a Q&A part two. That way you guys can get to know me a little better and I'm gonna finish answering your questions. And we're gonna have a little mukbang too because I am freaking hungry. Get in my belly! So without further ado, let's get started with these questions. So we got Papachino, that's what Jocelyn calls it. And it looks so freaking bomb. I'm starving. I'm hungry! Go to the kitchen, damn it! Make me a cheeseburger! Mmm. Oh my gosh. So first question, how old am I? I am 26 years young. And it is definitely true when they say that kids make you feel older. Because honestly, I feel like a freaking 36. I'm told! I beg your pardon? brings me to the next question how many kids do I have I have three and whenever I told y'all guys that I had them back to back to back I wasn't kidding my oldest Jossie she is eight and we call her Jossie then my middle one is Zania she is seven and we call her Nanny or my Nanny Boo and then last is Zeus and he is six and we just call him Zeusy or I always call him Pop Pops now that they're getting older they are very independent already and they pretty much do everything by themselves like literally all I do is make dinner they do their own laundry and chores and even whenever I ask them if they need help they're like no I got it D -E -P -E -D -E -D -D I'm sad about that they're growing up way too fast that little baby is all grown up okay next question when is my birthday and my birthday is already passed. It was June the 9th. So that makes me a Gemini. And I'm really not into the horoscopes much. Like if I see a post about it on Snapchat or on Facebook or anywhere, I will read and see what it says for my sign. But that's about it. And this next question, I was like, what the heck? Like, why would anybody want to know this? But it was, what do I smell like? And I hope it's good. To Then I like started thinking about it and I was like, oh, okay, they probably mean like what's my favorite perfume or my scent. And that would have to be Aqua by Giorgio Armani. I don't know how to say it right and I'm not even going to try to pronounce it. So that is my go-to scent. And I also like the Dolce in light blue. I'm excited to try the sweet and sour chicken. It looks freaking amazing. Mm, next question. How tall am I? Um, I wasn't exaggerating whenever I said that I am freaking short, but since you asked, I will let y'all know I am only 4'11". What? So I'm not even 5 foot, and it sucks, and I freaking hate how short I am. I wish I was just a little bit taller, maybe like 5'3". <laughs> Oops, I skipped a question. Sorry, guys. It was, what is my favorite man scent or like guy cologne? And that would have to be the one by Antonio Banderas. It's blue. I think that's the actual name of it, but the actual cologne is blue. And it smells freaking amazing for my husband. And whenever he wears it, I just want to freaking pounce on him. Like, no joke. But he likes the um, Abercrombie and Fitch in Fierce. And that one doesn't smell bad. It smells good, but I prefer the Antonio one. All right, next question. Do I have any fur babies? And yes, we have two. The boy is Wolfie, and he is Alaskan Shepherd, and he is all black, and he has wolf in him too. He's super gorgeous. I will have pictures of them up on the screen. And then I just recently got a puppy, Alaska. That's what I named her. She is barely six months, and I believe she's mainly husky. I don't know what else she has in her. Those are our fur babies. I forgot I was actually going to show you guys the nails that I just got for Thanksgiving. They are super cute. I will post them on the screen. My nail lady is amazing. If you live in the Texas area, definitely hit her up. Next question, do you watch any competition shows? And if you do, what are your favorites? Um, yes, I freaking do, especially since the whole virus happened and we were quarantined. We were already big, like, TV show and movie people, but it just got worse. And my favorite competition shows right now would probably have to be The Masked Singer. 
We love that show. Me and the kids watch it um, every week. And my favorite character right now on that is The Sun. Um, I think it's Demi Lovato, but I am not sure anymore. At first I thought it was her, but she has an amazing voice. And then I also watch The Voice. And my favorite judge on that show would probably have to be John Legend. Um, I just love his music. My favorite contestant on the show would probably have to be Cammie Clune. Her voice was amazing and it gave me the freaking goosebumps. Not kidding. And I want to apologize if I'm saying the word freaking a lot like every other word. I am trying so hard not to cuss in my videos, especially because my children watch them. And I don't know if any other younger kids do also. So I'm starting to say freaking instead of the F word question what is my skin type and it is freaking pill i want to make sure that no matter how ghostly i am my face still looks flawless af when picking your foundation it is super duper important that you pick a shade that is exactly close to your skin tone now that we have the perfect shade match as you can tell <laughs> i'm just kidding but i am super white like i have a very fair skin tone and i burn easily so my skin type is sensitive and without makeup, I am super, super red, and I am extremely oily as well. So that's why I try to be on point with my skincare, because since my skin is super oily, I do break out a lot, especially if I eat certain things, so I try to avoid those. And I love using matte products. next question what is my occupation and before the whole virus hit um, I was an instructor at the gym and I taught ride which is cycling and I did an app solution it was an app class and I taught TRX which is using those yellow um, bands that are like hanging from a wall or ceiling and you use those using your body weight. And I do miss it. I haven't went back yet because whenever school started again, I was homeschooling. And then they recently took that away for virtual learners and went back to school. So I'm a stay-at-home mom right now. And it's pretty boring. That's why I haven't made any vlogs or anything like that. I just stay home and clean and film and edit. Which brings me to my next question. Do I edit my own videos? And yes, I do. I actually really enjoy the process. I mean, sometimes it can be kind of tedious and take a while. Next question. Will you be doing different types of videos? And yes, um, I will besides makeup tutorials. I don't think that I will do very much vlogs because like I said, my day is pretty freaking boring. I'm just a stay at home mom. So right now there's not much going on unless you guys want to see me clean all day. I will be doing some challenges soon, so y'all stay tuned for that. And I wanna get in some clothing hauls also because I love clothes and fashion. Also, I am up for pretty much anything, so if there's anything specific you want to see for one of my videos, make sure to drop it down below in the comments or you can reach me at my socials and those will be up on the screen as well. Yeah, they put onions in this. I don't like onions, guys. Next question. If you could collab with one celebrity, who would it be and why? Probably be, excuse me, Ariana Grande. Of course, I love her music and her. Or it would probably be Becky G. I love her music also, and they both inspire me. What languages do you know? And I only know English. Spanish, I can understand it, but it's like very minimal and whenever it's crazy because somebody can speak Spanish to me and usually I know, like I understand, I know what they're saying and also I found out that I can read Spanish, I just don't know what I'm saying. I would love to learn different languages. I think knowing Spanish would be first and then after that I want to learn Italian. Next question, what is your favorite movie? And that's a hard one because we watch movies so much. I really like a lot of them, but I'm just gonna go ahead and pick two because they are totally different. The first one's an action movie, and that would be The Accountant with Ben Affleck. It is super good. If you haven't seen it, I recommend it. And then the next one is a cartoon, of course. Um, I watch it all the time with my kids. 
but it would be Coco. That movie makes me cry like a baby every time because I can totally relate to that. Um, I, I lost my dad at a very young age. I was five when he passed and then so my grandparents raised me and ended up adopting and my grandpa or dad, he passed away about four years ago. So I can totally relate and that movie makes me cry. Next question, what is your favorite makeup to do or makeup look? And honestly, it's everywhere from doing wedding makeup to Halloween makeup. I love makeup in general, so I love everything. And the second half of that question was what is my least favorite makeup to do? And that would be like minimal makeup. Like I just feel, and this is my personal preference, but I feel like if you're going to put makeup, you might as well go big or go home. Like unless you wake up late, of course, which then I will do minimal or no makeup at all. And that doesn't necessarily mean I won't upload a minimal makeup tutorial because I totally can, just not my favorite. Good morning, you too. Good morning. Got your results back. And, uh, uh, I'm sorry, but the test was positive. You're a basic bitch. So we only have two more questions left. The next one is describe yourself in three words. One would be short because you already know I told you how tall I am. Um, two would be nice. I try my hardest to be nice and have a kind heart, but if I don't like you, you will definitely know. I don't care if you don't like me. I love me. And number three would definitely be girly. I love bling so much and everything girly. And the last and final question for this video is, what are three words others use to describe you? And the first one, I'm gonna say short again. I get that a lot. The second one, people say I am feisty, which I probably am a lot. Yeah, definitely, it's that Latina blood. Some people are born with attitude. She has it. And the last one, I would have to say... Well, that's a big question. That's a very hard one. That's a hard one to answer. You can't just put me on a spot like that. I could not think of a third thing, so I'm going to ask my daughter since she's home. So name one word that describes mommy. Mm. You can pick anything, you're not going to get in trouble. <laughs> nice. Nice. Yeah. Okay, I guess I'm nice. Thank you, baby. Uh -huh. Oh, she was so shy. I love her so much. And that is all the questions for this week's Q&A Part 2 video. I hope that I answered most of the questions that you had for me. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And comment down below what video you want to see next. And if you want to connect, you can reach me at my socials. Those will be up on the screen and also down below in the description box. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.